Everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of It's Jenkins. This episode of It's Jenkins is brought to you by Black Knight QS. Black Knight QS, putting the black in your night. All right, well, last mission opened my eyes to a few things. So I made a few changes to some of the mechs, just the light tweaks here and there to make things probably a little bit better. For the Savage Wolf, we ran into heat problems, which was a big deal, mostly because of the large improved heavy laser. I just don't have the ability to sink the heat with that. That that weapon to me screams medium mech built around that weapon as the main weapon and then a couple of other minor things for like like either ballistic or a couple of missile weapons for less heat, right? So what I ended up doing was swapping it out for ER uh, large laser clan. So, I mean, the damage is less, it's 55 damage. But the difference is, is we'll be able to fire it continuously. Our heat sinking is perfect now, pretty much. Um, and it's got greater range. It's got the same range as the Goss rifles. So we'll be able to use it continuously and just keep this guy in the in the in the uh, back firing from a distance. Now I I, I got to address the ammunition issue here at some point. We're definitely going to need more shots for the uh, Hyper Goss. I think I don't know how I'm going to squeak that in here. We I mean I could drop armor. I could drop a ton of armor probably and squeak it in there. But I, I want to see if we can get some patchwork materials in the next little bit to at least offset a bit of that. Uh, but yeah, that's kind of where this thing is at right now. I mean, we have feral lamellar, so I mean, that really helps out around the board, right? Um, so, I mean, we'll see. I don't know. We'll see how this goes. I, it still feels a little underwhelming to me, but for 75 tons, but we'll see how it plays out. Then the avatar, I did kind of do what I was said I was going to do. I was going to do a little minor change to the PPC loadout on this thing. So... Uh, we did get the Heavy Streak PPC in here, and uh, my I, I, we had a Rocket 10 and a Rocket 5. We had an extra ton and a half, so I upped the Rocket 5 to another 10, dropped another Rocket 10 in. So minus these three, which are five heat each, if we look at the heat up here, um, we're pretty much flush. So we should be able to fire the Streaks, a pair of ER mediums, and a regular large laser uh, all at the same time. So this guy... I don't know. We'll see how it goes. We have a lot of prototype double heat sinks in here. Um, I, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. It I just feels, once again, it's a nice, big, heavy, hard-hitting weapon. It's got pretty good accuracy. It's got a bit of recoil to it, uh, but we can offset that slightly with this plus the pilot. So, I mean, I don't know. I mean, we've got um, tracker sensors for hitting this thing long range, uh, range finder, and energy accuracy. So, hopefully, this thing is hitting a fair bit. It'll uh, kind of make it worth it. But I don't know if it was worth trading a pair of ER PPCs for. Like clan ER PPCs that were doing 75 a pop. Because both of those weigh less than this. And both of those do about the same heat as this, right? So if we go down to the ER PPCs. Right, they're 56 a pop. So it's 112 for two. Whereas this is 90. So for another 22 heat, we're getting an extra 50 damage. Although we do, we don't quite have the accuracy, but I don't know. I, I, we'll see how it goes. I mean, we can sink the heat no problem. Um, so let's just run this and see how it goes. And then I made one minor change to the vindicator. Like I said, I was going to do. I pulled out the exchanger, replaced it with just a single shot rocket. That's all I had that could go in there. I mean, we had some handheld grenades that could fit on, but. This guy doesn't close anyway, so hopefully that rocket pack will help out a little bit until we can get some targeting computer in there. Trebuchet remained the same. I was going to make some minor tweaks to it, but I decided against it. I was going to replace the pulse laser, the ER pulse, and the arm. But it is our kind of longest firing weapon besides the uh, the shotgun. So I figured I'd leave it. Uh, it's got bonus accuracy as well, but I was going to replace that with the X-Pulse that we have. But I just figured this is probably a better weapon for this mech. Now, we do have 9 tons on this thing, so I can probably f swap out. Like, we could easily swap in the, the 3 flamers from the Vindicator. You know? And drop, like, the 2 like the two X pulses and the medium pulse laser. And keep the p -p 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 pulse laser in there. Um... But yeah, that's that that could that could become the flamer mech once we get the other quick draw up, and we'll use the vindicator as the the off mech. 
I might pull the stuff out of this and put it on, like the PPCs out of this and put it on the new uh, quick draw. But we'll see how it goes. I don't know. That's going to be after this month's over. Probably so it'll be next week. But we got everyone back. Let's go ahead and take a mission today. I know which one we're going to do. So let's just jump straight into it. Let's take go a after pull up a chair. Uh, this guy here. So Tamron. Oh, no, sorry. This one right here. Um, yeah, I'm going to save this for for another time once we have the... Uh, well, this will probably be gone at the end of the month anyway, but maybe the second Lance can do this one. Tamron Ever is usually tough, so we'll see how that goes. But anyway, uh, we're going to take this uh, battle against the Marians, three skull straight up uh, assassinate mission, see what we can get out of this. Uh, I'm going to go 312, I think. We're going to take some sea bills on this one. Um... Because the, the three extra parts, I mean, I, we might get lucky, we might not, but I would rather have the sea balls, I think, at this point. We're taking some good damage when we're going down for battles, so I just want to make sure we're uh, we're kind of mitigating as much of that as we possibly can. All right, let's see. This, i, I got to clear these out, too. So I've been thinking about what we're going to do for the new series. Yeah, see, this time it loaded in just fine. So we got the Duke and the Pegasus. Pegasus is going to pull out. You're going to go over here. And we're bringing down the Hetzer. Let's do that. Right? Yep, let's go. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Command interface initiated. Alright, well, here we go. See the target anywhere? Yeah, he's right there. Uh, where are we and what map are we on? Wait, is this the valley map? Um, oh, it's this map. Oh, okay. So, he, they've got defenders there. And he's back here. Uh, let's just... Okay, they're... Okay, no, not from over there. I was going to say, they're going to get reinforcements from over here. But it doesn't look like that. So, it's just the one lance protecting him? No surprises? I don't want to be in the water. Well, I guess I could. I could start here and push up into here to take these guys on. Or do we want to just kill him and then, like... Because he... I mean, he just runs around the background anyway. And then we'll have the, the straight-up battle. Sure. Why not? They got a flyer s somewhere. A gallant? Really? Hunchback. Pirate Vespa. No armor. Light MML carrier. It's a lot of MMLs. FB. Yes, Commander. Uh, well. That's a lot of stuff, and that's a lot of armor. He's going on 20. What are we on? 25, 21. A bunch of us on 20. You know what? Fuck this guy. I've got a sensor lock. Let's get him. Let's get him moving hard, kill it, hit him hard and fast. Like this. Got it. Why are we starting off damaged? Oh, the head. Uh That's garbage. But we need to do this. Probably gonna have to be the front. Just see what we can get out of this. We gotta push him back. Oh, we hit with oh primary target damage, Commander. Yeah, baby. Alright, the flamer hit the front. Alright. 
So what does he push Captain back Commander. to? 17. And the Black Knight goes on 15. Do I just push him back? Give the Black Knight an opportunity to get a shot on him? Or do we just continue to inflict damage on him? Probably. If we can hit him. I don't think we're going to get the kill on turn one, but we might be able to do enough damage to him to make him run. Taking the shot. Maybe not. And maybe we won't. Ready for orders. You don't have ping. How far? Yeah. 24%. Good enough odds for any friggin' Roger. Guy on my team. Any heads or pilot, really. Take the 24. Come on, land it, baby. I'm taking the shot. No, I thought that was gonna hit for sure. Standing by. I wanna push him back. I think so. No shooting, just run. Got it. We're gonna push him back. Yeah. And I didn't. You know what? After this. Okay, you know I say that? I was going to say, after this mission, I'm going to go and set all my weapons up, but what's the chance of that happening? Front shot, please. Firing all weapons. Uh, he still goes before me. Damn it! There was a waste of an OP. Yeah, that AMS change was a good one. That AMS change uh, was definitely a good one. Oh wait, I can push him back again. Going full throttle. No, I can't. That's all right. We'll just shoot him. Let's see what he does. He's a master sergeant, so could be bad times. They're probably all MML 3s. They're gonna just get eaten up. Landed a few though. I await your command. Oh, that's a bonus. We do go before him. We do go before him. We won't get the kill, but at least everyone's under our AMS. Well. If we get lucky. If not, well, well, we've been doing some pretty good damage to the front here already. Locked and loaded. Oh, for f really? At least his sensors are impaired, right? Am I right? Welcome to my AMS. I'll laugh at your puny attack. Yeah, it's the silver bullet one. I don't like that. I'm interested to see what this guy's got, though. Oh, streak PPC. Or not streak, what's it called? LBX. That's what it is. This guy's going on 20. Did I push him back again? I mean, I probably should. My chances to hit are garbage. I want to use the, uh, the ping, but... If I do that, he's just going to move out of there and I might not get another chance to shoot at him. So he's going on 20. We got 17. Hetzer's not going to be able to that. 
Not going to be able to capitalize on it, really. You know what? Let's just wait and see what he does. Holding for tactical advantage. There's not much... I mean... I'm going to move in and I'm going to ping him. So let's see what he does. Oh, he's moving forward. Interesting. Lose an armor. Good to go. Uh, hold off. I want to ping him first, so we're gonna do that. Comes the streak again, or the uh, LBX PPC. Showing minor damage. It's too far away. Yep. Just for now. We'll be back in a minute. Back in a minute. Waiting for orders. You, on the other hand, uh, can wait. You all can wait. All y'all. We're going to tank our initiative next turn, but we should have a way better chance at this guy once I ping him. Standing by. Get over here. Got a lock. All right. Don't know how much yep. that's going to help, but we're going to find out here in a second. I want the front shots, so let's go here. On my way. I want to kill this turn or next. Hopefully it's this one, but we'll find out. Taking a shot. Keep stripping that armor. How are we doing? Ah, about halfway on the front almost. I'm ready. I don't like these guys. Yep. Helps a little bit, I guess. Confirmed. Okay, stripping that armor. Nice shooting, man. Got something you want done? Definitely stripping my armor. I can't get a shot at him. Oh, yeah, I can. Um, I don't have enough. Shoot. Okay, let's get to here. I was going to say I was going to vigilance this to get ahead of these guys, but I'm in a bad spot here, but we got to get this guy dead. Wind it up. Yep, everything. Engaging target. There we go. Ah, that rockets did it too. We ain't going anywhere. We ain't going anywhere. Receiving you. All right, buddy. Well, We're now faced with a problem of water. Well, we'll take the shot in this guy. Okay, a little bit of damage. He knows we're here anyway. What do you need? Stay out of the water. You get better sensors against you when you're in the water. I think we're out of range with the, uh, oh, we're not, with the double 20. Uh, let's give it to him. Confirm. Oh, yeah. I can only imagine what the enemy must think. They see the, the double 20 hatcher and they're like, ah, oh, you know, he's got a lot of recoil, he's probably not going to be able to hit anything, and he's Red like four. driving around like a maniac. There's no way he's hitting anything, and then he pulls oh. up pulling off ridiculous maneuvers and just still shoots them and they're like how is he doing that how is he hitting people that shouldn't happen Go on. all right not bad yeah i'm glad i kept that uh medium pulse laser Ooh, 
Who are you? Who are you? I keep my left side to them. I got nothing in the left, so there's no point in like worrying about that side. 28. Nothing. Really? Oh, it's a Sha Yu. Sha me, Sha Yu. Let's fire this guy. Roger that. Orders? You're a bit out of position. Let's do that, though. Sensors locked on. Okay. Get back here. On my way. Double time. Getting the AMS protection. Good to go. All right, Quickie. Um, wow, uh, bad positioning. Actually, let's do this. Get our speed up, and hopefully we get ahead of everybody next turn, and we can just like blast off after that hunchback. I gotta feel we gotta kill a hunchback first, I think. Get rid of that silver bullet. Copter's gonna be problematic. Thirty-two. Take the shot on this guy though. Locking on. All right, landing one is good. Guy's gonna die. Didn't get any of them. Yes, Commander. How are we doing? We're doing really well. Till we gotta move into the water, and then screw me. I, I gotta shoot that hunchback. Confirmed. So I guess we sprint two hexes into the water. <laughs> Take a shot at this guy. He's gotta go. Taking him on. Primitive. Inflicted some heavy damage. Black Knight really does shine at long range. I mean, that's what it was set up for. I tried to get, um, in the Vindicator, I tried to get the that anti-air bolt-on on, put on because I thought it would be a nice weapon to have against like flyers like this guy. But um, it's four tons, and I only had three and a half available, unfortunately. Al, losing armor left and right here. Yeah, we're all losing armor. Ready for orders. Do you have your ping up? Not yet. Next turn. So let's not go where somebody can see you. We'll get your ping on next turn to get that guy's uh, thing down. Pirate snub knows PPCs. Oh, yeah. oh, it's a pirate snub. Failed to connect. Interesting. Standing by. The speed on this thing, my God. Right there. Understood. Move it back. Getting further into the trees makes it harder for them to hit me. That's what I keep telling myself. Alright, well, shooting this guy. Ooh, the streaks didn't hit. Target's taken a critical Oh, he's hit. got a pirate goss. Okay. This fucking guy here. Is he going to turn and shoot, or is he going to just... Nope, he's not. Got too much speed. Yeah. Only got machine guns now. Bugging out. Gotta park right here. We'll move up again next turn. Drop our recoil. This guy, though, is becoming a pain in the ass. It might be a good grab, though. 
Ooh. Oh my god. I was not expecting that. Obviously. Commander. Fuck. Oh boy, we just got that damn thing back too. Oh, really? All right, well, I guess we're getting on the Shah Yu. Shaw me, Shaw you. He's just sitting there too. I don't know why. Engaging with target. He's like, he's like, oh, they can't see me. I'll just sit here and hopefully they'll just, <laughs> they'll just go around me and I'll, they'll forget that I'm here. Oh fuck, they see me. Okay, now I gotta fight. That's pretty much what happened. He just didn't do anything. Oof, nice shot. Someone's got a lot of X pulses. Not much armor left in that location. Commander? Roger. As much as I want to go after this guy. He's on 11, Black Knight's on 8. Damn, I should really shoot this guy then. Uh, let's vigilance you. We'll get after the other guy next turn. Let's shoot this guy. I call me. Oh crap. Really? That's it? <sighs> you couldn't even capitalize on it, huh? That's what I didn't want. Now we're on fire. Reporting. Critical hit. Commander? As much as I want to target this friggin' aircraft. I don't know where he's going to end up though next turn. He's going he's moving way too fast. Let's just try and kill this guy. Okay, the AMS is back. That guy's going on 20, really? This guy's on 22. Fuck. Shit. <sighs> Standing by. That MML is going to murder this guy. My vehicle's on twelve. Eighty and sixty. If I get lucky, I get the kill. If I get lucky. Um. But then next turn. Like, can I kill this guy? Four X pulses. Look at that, eh? Eleven points. Silver bullet goss is up as well. We're on 17, so I'll go, this guy will go, and then this guy will go. No, he goes, then this guy goes, and then I go. I call me. Let's give the guy, let's give these guys something else to shoot for. They're gonna go after the Vindicator. They, uh, They'd be stupid not to. But if we can draw their attention. Roger. Yeah. Not enough.
He's just this guy's just too fast at the moment, so he can't really do too much. At least he's staying in the fight, you know. Yeah, okay, good. Change targets. All right. Now we strip both half the armor off. Receiving you. Uh Got a lock. Question is, do I try to capitalize and hit? Oh yeah, I'm gonna go after this guy. We might get lucky and get that torso, one of the torsos. All we gotta do is get a fragment, fragment shot right there. Let's try it. Of course not. That's a miss. Damn. Fuck. Brutal. Don't bail out. I want your headgear. I'm hit. Yeah, just relax. Just don't bail out whatever you do. On the move. Whatever you do, don't bail out. Okay. On this guy. Finish him off, hopefully. That should do it. Yep, okay. One less target. Good fight. I'm receiving you. I can't even sprint in front of the Vindicator. Like, I <laughs> don't... <laughs> my move and my sprint is exactly the same in the water. Alright, go here. Position confirmed. I'm gonna shoot this guy and hopefully hit the guy in the front here as well. Now we're just too good. Guy's core exploded. That's a kill. Good thing our vehicle wasn't there. Waiting for orders. All right, buddy, hang in there. Okay, ready for action. Are you? You you really think you are? Not that it's going to make that much difference, but let's try and get some vigilance going. And I'm going to hide here. <laughs> Just stand behind me. <laughs> oh God! Let's take a shot at him. Target lock on enemy's rear. Still in a fight. No weapons, pretty much, but still in the fight. Commander. Receiving you. All right. He's going on 20. What do we got? 8, 13, 10. Really? So even if I push him back, it's not going to matter. He's a warm build with the four X pulses, so let's hopefully we don't have the uh, anything we can use there. I mean, I could ping him, but our chances to hit this guy are so good because he's in the water. We got two of them on. Okay, not bad. Just stay right there. I'm a human shield. I'm blocking the guy. <laughs> oh, you're going to go after him, eh? I'm hit. Oh, better you than the Vindicator. 
besides, you got to show your fans how much how much how much balls you have and get some more friggin' scars, right? I'm assuming this guy's trying to use his jamming or something. I don't know. Hopefully, in the new version, um, some of that wackiness will be resolved. I copy. So I've been trying to think about like how I want to run my next series because uh, it's definitely going to be doing the um, the VTOL series or the Lamb series for sure. See, buddy, this is how you do an X Pulse build. Reporting. Critical hit. I'm ready for orders. Uh, so what I'll probably do because I think oh shit. The, this series, I don't want to say went off the rails, but I really should have just been keeping the main lands with just quick sell and just going quick sell fighting and not go with the second lands. Then if I was going to do second land stuff or do something like that, um, run a separate series, you know, and just keep them separate. Target neutralized. It makes the playthrough a little easier on me. Uh, simply because. There's less I have to focus on each series. My God, really? Put one in the back. Oh, one of the fragments hit. Nice. So yeah, that's what I'll probably do: is stick with the uh, lambs on the one, like in one series, and then in a second series, I'll probably run something else. We'll see how it goes. I don't know. I'll start off with the lambs and just see how it's progressing. And then I'll worry about the other stuff afterwards. Acknowledged. Alright, we're gonna ping this guy. I've got a sensor lock. Orders. Stay behind him, but get out of the way of everybody else. Okay, that ain't bad. Shouldn't take long. Shouldn't take too long to kill this guy. Receiving you. Eleven activations. Okay, we're kind of okay. As long as you don't move around, we're kind of okay. Locked on for your armor. Yeah, whatever. That's all right. Reporting negative damage. The Duke should be able to take care of this. Oh, I think. What's up, boss? Well, side shot it is, I guess. There we go. Heading out. I think this thing's damaged on this side. So yeah, definitely going to be Chinese jet pilot for the Lamb series. Let's go this one. On target. There we go. Oh man. Could have been so much worse than what it was. Go down. We probably... Well, I don't know. I was just going to say we probably should have taken these guys on first, but I'm kind of glad we didn't with seeing that vehicle back there. Mission successful. That MML carrier, though, that was pretty brutal. Hope we didn't lose the Hetzer on this one. We don't know. We lost pretty much all the... <laughs> we lost all the weapons, but all the other stuff... The good stuff remains, so this is definitely not going to be a PPC build. Modular armor we lost too. Damn. Well, I mean, uh, I guess it helped it from spilling over to the torso. Alright, just some crits in the center. We should be okay there. All the headgear is okay. Alright, so it's not too bad, I guess. It could be way worse. Alright, you're going to argue, are you? Two parts of the Gallant. The Shayu is one part. Hunchback. What do I want out of this? That's my question. There's probably only two parts of the Gallant, which means there's no point in grabbing that. This guy's core exploded, so there's only one part of the Hunchback, which I don't have to worry about. 70 cores. Patchwork materials, tier 3, quantity 12. Yes, please. Yeah, we'll take that. That's fine. That's a pretty good trade, I think. So, MML light carriers. Do I have any light carrier parts in storage? Why is it not showing me now? 
Does that mean I don't? Probably not. Yeah, no, I don't. Oh, I do. So why didn't it show me that? Those should be compatible. Right? Shouldn't they? Paramedium X pulses. MG duels. MML fives. So there's the the snub nose pirate PPC minus one accuracy recoil of three. I wonder if that copter. I wonder if this thing damaged itself because it has misfire, right? Oh shit! Really? Really? See ya. <laughs> Battle computer optics. Thermal. So this is. Is this go? Is this just go in the bolt-on slots? Battle computer heat tracking is good, but hold on for a second. Increased missile range. There's all the patchworks. I really hope we get two or three of those in the uh, roll, because I can't really afford to uh, grab those with everything else that's on the ground. So no battle computer. I think we got to grab the tracking as well. I mean, hmm. See, here's the thing. At, at higher level, the heavier your mechs get, the less evasion the enemies generate. So you're really, the only evasion you get are like if you're fighting battle armor or fast moving vehicles or things like that. But most mechs don't generate very much evasion anyway. Because you've, you've seen how many times I go, I go to sensor lock somebody and it doesn't matter, right? So is the one ton better used? Like, this is great if you've got a bunch of weapons. If you've got a couple of weapons, yeah, I guess. Well, let's take it. As much as I want a couple of these, I've still got one. Plus two that are coming out of the trebuchet once we make some changes I think although now that I've seen that last battle I'm kind of hesitant to pull out the X pulses anyway let's go this route and see what happens we lost the Hetzer I don't think I got another quick sell part though so this can go I'll hang on to the MML 5s what do they weigh 3 tons each yeah, we'll hold on to them and see what happens. And we got none of the, uh, really? <sighs> That's like par for the course for me. Uh, we'll, uh, we'll hold on to those, I guess. I'll hold on to that, sure. Yeah, well. At least we got two of the parts back, 212. It's not too bad, I guess. I mean, we did lose a bunch of gear. Although the return on investment, I think, the, the optics and stuff like that, I think that's well worth it. I'm wondering if there's a way we can work that into the uh, Black Knight. We gotta wait for it to come back anyway, so let's get Black Knight to the top. Quick draw to the top. Uh, mm. So like that. Oops, not you. You. You come down. So in five days, eight days. So in nine days, all, the, all these guys will be back. The Vindicators are rebuild. Which I'm not that worried about. We'll be bringing forward the other one. The Vulture's got to be... Yeah, Vulture and Orion will be coming back. So we'll probably... I don't know. We might jump off this planet or I might just sit here. I don't know. We'll, we'll see what, ha what happens. But we do have another mission we can take with the other Lance. Because we do have all the mechs back for that Lance now. Right? So we're good to go with them for the next mission. And then the one after that will be all... Will be this Lance, hopefully, with... Uh, 
uh, maybe both quick draws back. I think there's a good option. I think we can do that. I think we can get both quick draws into the battle. But I am going to leave this episode here, everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And please drop your comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later. <laughs>